Hello, everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an exciting topic to discuss, the Wi-Fi QR Code API. In this video, we'll explore what a Wi-Fi QR Code is, why you should use it, and how to create one using the Wi-Fi QR Code API. So, whether you're a developer looking to integrate this feature into your app or just curious about this technology, this video is for you. Let's dive right in. To start, let's clarify what a Wi-Fi QR Code is. A Wi-Fi QR code is a quick and convenient way to share your Wi-Fi network credentials with others. Instead of manually entering the SSID and password, you can simply scan a QR code to connect to the network. It's a fantastic feature for businesses, home users, and anyone who wants to simplify the process of sharing their Wi-Fi access. But why should you consider using Wi-Fi QR codes? Well, there are several benefits. Let's go over some of them. Firstly, with a Wi-Fi QR code, connecting to a network is incredibly fast. No more fumbling with passwords, just scan the code, and you're in. They are also more secure. You can set them to expire after a certain period, ensuring that only trusted individuals have access to your network. Lastly, sharing your Wi-Fi credentials becomes a breeze. You can print out QR codes for guests, display them on your business premises, or even send them via messaging apps. Now that we've established why Wi-Fi QR codes are great, let's talk about how to create them using a Wi-Fi QR code API. An API, or Application Programming Interface, is a set of rules and protocols that allows different software applications to communicate with each other. From the browser of your choice, go to QR Code API and sign up for the free trial. Once signed up, the dashboard will reflect your cycle usage. Under it, there will also be some other important details. These include Total number of API requests allowed The number of requests used The number of days remaining for your account Besides these, you will see the option to get API key. Click on the Create button under it. Now, if you chose to sign up via Google in the first step, a six-digital code will be sent to your email. You'll have to copy it and go back to where you left on the QR API website. Here, paste the code into the required field. Once you do it, you will see your API key on the screen. Copy this API key. On the left side, you'll see the Documentation tab on the menu bar. Click on it. Here, you will have to scroll down a bit to find the Authorize button on the right. Now, you need to click Authorize. Then you will see a window prompting you to paste the API key in the value box. Once done, click on Authorize again. Then, select the Wi-Fi category. Up next, click on Test. On the page that loads, you will have to enter the exact name of the required Wi-Fi network and some other details. In the same step, you can also start customizing the QR code design. For the uninitiated, here are the exact elements that can be customized in a QR code. Color and pattern of eyes. Color and pattern of data modules. Background color. Logo in the center. Background image. Once you're done finalizing the content and other parameters for the QR code, click on the execute button. Now you will see responses such as curl, response URL, and response body. On scrolling down further, you'll see the image of a QR code having the email you had encoded. You can then copy the response URL and integrate it into your own information system or mobile application. Make sure that you test scan the QR code before proceeding. This will ensure that QR code functions correctly. Note that the Wi-Fi QR code created will be static in nature. That means it will be permanent and non-editable. In addition, it will prompt Android users to join the network automatically when scanned. On the other hand, iOS won't allow users to join the network automatically. In the case of iOS, scanning the QR code will show the Wi-Fi credentials. And that's how you create a Wi-Fi QR code using a Wi-Fi QR code API. It's a fantastic solution for simplifying Wi-Fi network access and enhancing security. Whether you're a business owner, a tech enthusiast, or someone who simply wants to make their Wi-Fi more accessible to guests, this technology is worth exploring. Thank you for joining us today. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more QR code related content. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, feel free to leave them in the comments below. We'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.